Hey guys, welcome back to The Savant Life and today I'm really excited to be making this video and I'll tell you why. When you think of motor vlogging in India, you think of two names automatically. You think of Mumbai Kar Nikhil and you think of Augie F. Now while Nikhil's face is all over YouTube and I'm sure many of us would recognize it from a mile away on the crowded streets of Bindi Bazaar, Augie F has been quite the mystery, forever seeking refuge in that calm voice of his and that icon helmet that has become so synonymous with him. Now let me tell you right at the outset, I personally don't know Augie, but having watched a number of his videos, I think he's one of the most sensible and one of the most well-spoken motor vloggers that we have in this country. And I think that only adds to his appeal and makes him more likable across the board. So just like a number of you, I have always wondered, listening to his voice, what he must actually look like. So in what is quite a coinkydink, which is American slang for coincidence. Earlier this week, I was on Facebook just jumping through some random profiles like I sometimes do, and all of a sudden, one particular profile just struck out to me out of the clear blue sky. And at first I was like, no, 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 this is not happening, this cannot be. And then I took a second look, and I looked closer. And of course, it was Augie F. Not Augie F, the Facebook page, but the real, actual profile of Augie F. Because there he was in the flesh. I mean, not really in the flesh, it was on a laptop screen, but there he was. Without any mask, without any riding gear, and I saw the guy behind that iconic icon helmet. And I have to tell you, I was astounded. I mean, not because of the way he looks or the fact that getting to see someone's face is such a big deal, but... Even to this day, even as a grown-up, fully functioning adult, there are few things as exhilarating as stumbling upon a well-kept secret. So naturally, I wanted to scream and shout, I wanted to share it with people. But then if I picked up the phone and called my friends and told them, hey, listen, I just found out who Augie F is, they would have thought I lost my marbles because they have absolutely no interest in the motor blogging world and they certainly don't know who Augie F is. Now the other option was to go on Facebook and tell all of you guys, but that just would not have been the right thing to do because it's his thing, he intends to keep it a certain way, and uh, you should always respect that. So the only other option was to swallow back the excitement and uh, go back to pretending like I had not seen what I had just seen. But then, just as luck would have it, a couple of days later, Augie makes this video on YouTube, which was this Q&A video, and as I'm watching that video, for some reason I keep getting this feeling that he's very, very close to doing a face reveal. And then, voila, just a day later on Facebook, he actually confirms it in one of the comments to his posts that he will indeed be removing his helmet in the next video. So the timing of it just could not be better because now I can finally talk about this, I can share it with other people. No, 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 hold on, before you get any ideas, I'm not here to outscoop him, I'm not here to spoil the surprise, I'm not here to jump ahead in line and expose his face to you, I don't want to do any of that, of course I'm a fan of his, as I am of a number of other motor vloggers, so I only wanted to do my part in building up the excitement, in stirring the pot and making sure that everybody is as amped for this as I am, and probably just give you a little bit of a teaser, it's not going to be a photograph, but uh, let me just tell you this. So after having watched so many of his videos and having listened to that voice for so long, I always thought that Augie must be this uh, really young, fresh-faced, innocent-looking chocolate boy with an easy-going smile. And maybe you guys thought the same as well. If, if I had to put a picture to my thoughts, I thought or I guessed that Augie would look something like this. Oh, wait a minute, that's actually Rana Das Gupta, who's a writer and he's in his 40s, but something of that kind or maybe something close to this guy. But the reality, like they say, is always stranger than fiction because he does not look anything like a fresh-faced, innocent, chocolate boy. Uh, in fact, he has quite a stern look and he looks quite grown up. Uh, from whatever I could make out, I think he's definitely more than 24 or 25. He is probably in his late 20s, if not more. And uh, Kahani may twist, he's also got a beard. That is as much as I can tell you for now, but uh, I hope that gave you guys a little bit of an idea and maybe thickened the plot a little more, got you guys more excited and uh, at the edge of your seats. I think he's going to be doing the face reveal either in the video that he releases on Sunday or once he's back from his ride on Monday, but either ways, it's coming very soon. 
So stay tuned to his channel and uh, if you haven't already, subscribe to him as well. I'm really happy for the guy because I think he's a cool cat and he's uh, finally getting to do it on his terms and he's also I think going to be doing a subscriber meet very soon which is I think contributing towards his decision of removing the helmet. So there you have it, that's my little story. I hope it contributed in some way, shape or form in terms of building up the excitement and uh, raising the crescendo just a little bit. If you like the video, then hit the like button. If you have any friends who are also fans of RGF, then don't forget to share the video with them. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button because as always, it only takes a second. I'll see you the next time around.